awesome to do. You get to learn directions, ingredients, food safety, cleanup, measurements, and food techniques, and use equipment. So at home, make some brownies with a whisk and a spatula, or step it up a notch and make something like macaroni and cheese that only has a few simple steps, but involve your children at home in cooking. Number two, money management. This includes counting and spending money, savings and checking, bill paying, and things like that. To practice money at home, my wife and I used to glue things like 50 cents on the top of a popsicle stick, then we glued change to clothespins, and my daughter would simply match the denomination by clipping onto the popsicle stick. Great activity for the young ones. Okay, number three, sewing. This improves hand-eye coordination. It's therapeutic and it's original design. So if you're a sewing mom or dad, involve the kids absolutely. Let's move on to nutrition. This is talking about diet, metabolism, digestion, malnutrition, and nutrients. At home with my daughter, we used to play the veggie dice game and say the dice landed on orange. The dice that I had multi-colors on landed on orange. We would eat an orange or an orange pepper and talk about why orange fruits and vegetables are good. Great way to bolster nutrition at home. Next, housekeeping. Definitely involve your kids in cleaning and disinfecting the appearance, utilities, trash and recycling, and the chores. They need to know how to do these things. Next, laundry, detergent use, safety, drying and folding, things like that, like having a system and making sure you're using things like detergent safely and also fabric softener for the right reasons. Okay, let's move on. Let's go to meal planning. This is time management, grocery shopping, choices, and budgeting. Involve your kids in all that. It's a hugely important skill for when they have families. Next, number eight, home repairs. This is basic maintenance or teaching how to use tools and equipment safely. For my daughter, I set something like this up so she can practice her drill on the screws or the hammer on the nails back here. And now she loves to drill and hammer and have da help daddy with all our projects. Okay, lastly, etiquette number nine. This is teaching manners, dining, phone use, and internet. So there you have it, nine aspects of home and careers and what you can do at home. So do some home ec at home, keep reading, keep writing, but most importantly, be safe.